All right, well, let's do some more Animal Crossing for a bit. If you are watching this later on as a replay, thanks for uh, clicking the video. It's still pretty warm here. It's been just killer the past couple of days, but it did cool down today. But I think we're finally getting our summer, despite summer basically being over. It's like a couple of weeks of it left. Ugh, all right. Over the past couple of days off stream, I have ordered stuff, but it's going to contribute to today. Oh. Yeah. Well, there'll be that to uh, distract ourselves with as well. Okay. Well, let me just deal with the daily stuff and, uh, yeah. I'll get going. <laughs> That's struggling a little. Oh yeah, trees are growing now, so. This is still not a money tree, I'm not sure why. Alright. Uh, roses aren't duplicating. Okay. Well, let me... Quickly just do this. That's nice and easy as well. Self root. Okay. Well, I can do that when I go to the Daily Island. Ah, oh, Flick is here as well. Alright, well. Uh, I'm gonna try and get some small butterfly model. Probably take the socks off. There we go. There is something that I did get, uh, when was it? It's like last night, I think. Or maybe the night before. No, no one's moving away. Stop it. Uh, I'm replacing this with this. Assuming it lets me. Because I'm probably... Oh, hang on. It'll work. I think what I need to do is just temporarily get rid of this. There we go. That's better for outside, so... 
It was in the store. And I figured, yeah, that's much better. And it'll differ to what I have inside here. I just want to see if they're crafting. I mean, since I'm already here. I'm not crafting, okay. I'm gonna continue working on the beach, so... Alright. Uh, let me just go around and do the daily stuff real quick. So, recipe, uh... Work, halves, and then daily islands. Okay, that's recipe. I suppose I should bring stuff with me if I'm going to halves now. piled up the past three days. Um, I did check out the, uh, what do you call it? The Savali thing, so I think it's probably because of that. The Savali. Alright. I talked to everyone that day, so this would be why. Oh. Shit, that's today. Ha! <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, okay, that's why. Never mind. It's, it's kind of weird that everyone's writing to me. I thought it was because I attended an event and everyone did it, but okay. Did not know they do that. Yeah, I mean, look. <laughs> when you've got someone in your life that cares about Valentine's Day, then you worry about Valentine's Day. But I guess it slipped my mind. Right, I'm going to grab all this stuff. Um, what am I taking the halves, actually? Probably this. Definitely these. Stale cupcakes? Why stale cupcakes? Alright, hang on. I gotta put away these wheat fields, because that's. I picked these up in case I want to expand the farming area a bit. also check out if uh hang on oh they're the same valentine day gifts okay uh yeah yeah okay unglazed dish i don't think i've gotten this before that in a minute. I need to put all this other stuff away. I think at this point it's easy for me to just go indoors and put it away.
Hopefully no one comes over in that time. That's legit. I mean, that'll probably come out later. some extra cube lights as well, just in case. Hey, Shell, how's it going? Stale cupcakes? Is, is it because I didn't get them out? That might be why. I got my wristwatch. There's the bath stools. Really? Okay, hold on. Doing okay, how am I? Um, all right. Just finished up work, had some dinner, and yeah, just chilling. <laughs> kind of forgot what day it was, but it's fine. The game reminded me. Oh, no, it's a song. No idea. I'm gonna turn that watch into a gold one and go put it at the market that I've made. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day, thanks. I mean, it's the day where I only do something if I'm with someone that it warrants doing something with, but it's not the case this year, so I'm just chilling. Uh, let me... What is the song? Stale Cupcakes? Stale Cupcakes. Oh. It's like a lullaby. It's kind of uneary. So on. Oh, no, don't come over. <laughs> I need to do stuff. Why do you always come over when I've got stuff to do? I didn't let you in, you let yourself in. Do I have any other stuff to put away, I guess? Hang on. Okay, it's a cherry. I'll just do the card game and then go. Do I have all the flowers now? I do, I just want more blue roses, so I'm trying to duplicate them. And I'm just growing more green mums for decorations. I'm kind of working towards finishing the island now, so... I've been doing a lot of uh, remodeling. 
particularly around uh, the beach. Round table, round table. I think these were spares. I only need two, if I'm not mistaken. Today I'm going to be working more on um, what I've been working on at the beach, which is I kind of moved the fish market. I made a market dedicated to having a bunch of stalls. Um, I've just been reshuffling that corner quite a bit. I can get gold roses if I get five stars. Yeah, I've, I've got gold roses already. I've got plenty. I have them all now, so. Alright, I gotta go. Come on. She's one of the nicer visitors. Doesn't make you feel guilty when you gotta leave. Yeah, I mean, at this point, it's just getting a couple more blue roses so I can use them elsewhere. I've remodeled every villager house, so that's done. Yeah, look, I'll show you. See? All sorted. There's just two blue roses to go here. That's it. Call it at the color it's supposed to be. Like if this was orange and this was yellow and this was pink. Hmm. Let me see how that would look. I'll try with one. Looks like I'm going to get through the 20 shooting stars pretty quickly, so they'll start being a distraction after the next few minutes. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty happy with how things are going. Like, even this house is done now. Like, everything, as far as villager houses goes, is, is done. last time I was working on this rework here. I turned this area into a market. And then allowed the walking to the food trucks. Sort of started setting up the camping area. I need to just let this go for a little bit, but... The work today is going to be around here and this area here. I've kind of set this up a bit better. I made a bait and supplies store here. Which makes sense for it to go right next to the docks. And yeah, fish and chips restaurant. 
And then here I'm just gonna put like general beach stuff, so. That's the idea. Um, so what was it? This one was orange. Yeah, I have no idea how to decorate your island. I mean, have a look around. Get some ideas. I hear people go to Pinterest a lot, from what people in chat have been telling me. Just find something you like and I might give you ideas. convince me. <sighs> Damn it. The only thing is I gotta do this now to get this one out. It's okay. The shooting stars seem to be pretty constant. Let's just get this out of the way. Wait. Garden looks gorgeous. How dare I? How dare I what? I'm just doing one adjustment. This is just one of these things where I'd lose anyway. If I had a garden that didn't look nice, people would say, You can do better, why aren't you doing better? I've seen how I've seen you play other games where you make things look nice. Why does why does your garden look like horrible? I kinda got that at the start of the game. It was just like, dude, you can make your stuff look much nicer. Yeah, it's better. I like that. And then the others can remain just white. It's neutral. By the way, Mrs. Ham, you know how you keep talking about wanting to see the replays of me telling the stories about my uncle? Well, I made a dedicated video for it. Because I got around to editing that those streams out. Is that evening where all those conversations went down? They're like a separate video now. On the highlights channel. I've been trying to do more of that lately. It's just hard to pinpoint where certain conversations happened. I need to keep notes, like, at the end of a stream, write down, hey, today we talked about this. And I can track it down easy later. But I sort of figured it out. Wait, what color outfit? What, what I'm wearing now? I don't know, it's like... Red? Green? Alright, I'm going to work and then halves. I think I got the 20 I need. Yeah, I put that garden there because coincidentally two rocks were right next to each other, so then... I took advantage of that fact. I think it was one originally and then the second one grew and I was like, yeah, okay, I'm doing something here.
Oh, what color for you? Um, let's see. Maybe blue? Go with, like, opposite of me. Yeah, I mean, that's why I picked blue, because it's summer here, so I'm like, okay, warm colors. Winter, cold, cool colors. Blue. Oh, this is here as well today. Well, I already bought this, so that's okay. Um, what I might do is order a tent through here for tomorrow. I want to put one more tent. Maybe I'll get two just in case, but... Okay, hold on, let's think about it. Oh, see, I've still got ones... I still got designs that I didn't use, so... We'll get that one. And... You know what? I'll get the variations that I didn't get. So these ones. There we go. Definitely not the circus tent. That'll do. Then I have options. I mean, I'm not sure if it's going to be one or two. I'll, I'll figure it out. It won't be today because I've ordered them, so. I'm not working on the camping area anyway. You're making chocolates if I had made the wrong, used the wrong chocolate. What, so not cooking chocolate? I kind of forgot what day it was today until the game rem reminded me. <laughs> I'm just in my own world. Anyone got any got any plans? Oh yeah, I gotta get the recipe as well. Is it weird for me to say that I've only had like a souffle twice? I, I, I guess this is one of these things because for me to want something sweet, it's just, I have to be in the mood. It's not my go-to. But also, when... When you go out to somewhere to eat, I don't know if, I don't know how people do it, how they have a meal, and then they still have room for dessert. I just don't do it. Not, just, just, usually I eat and I'm content. Like, maybe I'll have some coffee afterwards, but to have more food, I don't know. No plans today. Do I have plans? Uh, nope. <laughs> just playing games. To be honest, I don't I don't do anything unless um it's like I'm with someone that I'm like, yeah, we should do something. So that's not the case this year. I completely forgot until the letter appeared in game. So I am I am just playing games. Well, I meant, like, Valentine's Day plans. But, yeah. I mean, I guess Tomb Raider's good. I mean, I'm playing Animal Crossing. Also gotta make an effort to finish, like, the other games that I'm working on. 
Titan. So I'm gonna try not to go too much overboard with time today. I think I'm like about halfway through both the games, like Wario and Nier. I sound tired, I'm a bit tired, yeah. Busy day, middle of the week. Oh, well. <laughs> Giving a present to your mom and twin, that's all. Okay. Yeah, I mean, the whole Valentine's Day thing is just... I appreciate the spirit of it, but I don't think it's a necessity, you know? I'm for all... I'm the thing... I'm, like, more of the opinion you don't need a, a day to serve as an, as an excuse to do something like that. And also, people... Well, I don't say people. I mean, businesses kind of take advantage of that fact. And things are sometimes more expensive in the lead up to Valentine's Day. So, I don't know. I'm more, I'd rather be more spontaneous than, like, rely on this specific day. But of course, if, if I know someone's into it, then I'll make an effort. Yeah, the old Valentine's surcharge. Just need to make this look random. Fucking couples, it's unnecessarily expensive. It depends where you go. But also, it's it's easy to say that when you're like outside of outside of it, you know. McDonald's. I mean, someone would appreciate, like, the gesture of that. It just depends on what the expectation is. It's like, do you appreciate the gesture and spontaneity, or do you want to go somewhere expensive? Because it's Valentine's Day. There's, like, two crowds, really. Okay, this is already in a form that I want. This one... Wasn't there one that... I mean, I guess I'll... I know I've used it a lot, but I'll, I'll get open. What else have I got? Oh yeah, the stools. I think I decided to go blue. If I would have remembered, I would have tried to look for unhinged dating sims or something for today, but I've just been busy lately, so... I didn't get the time this year. That's fine. I think it's probably for the best, because then I would probably ruin my Steam recommendations. The last time I did that... 
I think for the next couple of months, my Steam recommendations were basically just that. Because Steam figured, oh, he picked up a lot of these dating sims. All right, let's recommend dating sims to him. <laughs> so, or just straight up, you know, porn games. Like, that's what it became for a while. I had to keep clicking, not interested, not interested, and now my feed's, like, more or less normal. What about that unhinged Reddit thing? Yeah, but that's... that was just a discussion. See, I have two forms of tired. It's like one where I'm talking t slower. And then there's there's the morning voice where I can't hear my own voice, but apparently my voice is like a lot deeper than what it, well, maybe not a lot, but I've heard it's deeper than what it usually is. So I'm not sure. Like if I sound slower, then it might be just cause it's middle of the week and just a lot going on at the moment. Uh, alright, let's, I'm just gonna go do the daily island quick. Why? Why? Did I work from home? Yeah, I always do. Hey, come on. Come on. I mean, the only thing working from home grants you is just the commute is the difference, but it doesn't make my job easier by any means. The commute is definitely a big deal, but even before working from home, I, I like lived pretty close to work. So the commute wasn't too bad. But this is the thing, like, I get more done from home than I ever did in the office. So if anything, I'm working a lot harder at home than I'm working, than I was working in the office, like. The, uh, statistics we have don't lie. Definitely getting a lot more done at home. Part of, part of that is just there's less people coming to your desk or you're being interrupted less. So you can focus a bit more. We live three minutes away, but that school is another world. I mean, growing up, I used to live across the school, and we would we'd be late, <laughs> literally across the road getting up well okay i would get up i would get up late that would, that's a me problem and then just watching dragon ball up until the very last minute we could before we had to leave or whatever cartoon was on i think when we lived across the street i don't think dragon ball was on yet you should quit and find a work from home job it's becoming more and more a demand and that's why the recommendation is most industries, if possible, should do um, either fully remote or a combination of the two because workers are looking for that now and they're prioritizing it. So for Australia to remain competitive, to attract talent, companies should do that. Whether they like it or not. And the same goes for like... Uh, working four days a week instead of the five, like, that's gonna become more and more of a thing. Not everywhere, but just... 
industries that need to attract talent. I think I'm just here for the recipe. I might just grab the vines. That still happens. School starts at 8.30. Kids on the same street are coming at 8.45. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's because you think to yourself, okay, yeah, there's plenty of time, and then you kind of forget. You wish you were an engineer or something. I mean, it's never too late to swap careers. Like, I know people that make the effort and career change in their 30s, and... It's just because they're unhappy and they do it and it's a more positive thing. But it's pretty much, you know... I guess you have to visualize if you want to keep doing that. There's no way you're getting a hex debt again. I mean, you don't have to get into debt. Not necessarily. The way... Here's how I see it. I'm not sure if it's the case, but... There's a lot of cases where university degrees just prove that you're, uh, organized, right? Take me, for example. My degree was primarily in design work. Yeah? But, on the side, I taught myself coding. In my degree, there was basically no coding subjects. Like, I learned some, but it, was, it wasn't anything that was remotely applicable to, like, what was being used. But I still got a job. Coding stuff. Like, I, I did web development for a while and, um... Built software and stuff. So... But I didn't have to go get a new degree for it. I just was like, okay, yeah, I got a degree, and I also learned this. This is what I've built. I had a portfolio of stuff that I made to prove that I had the skill. Now, that's not applicable to everything. It depends what you want to do, but... Sometimes you can approach it in that manner, where there are ways to get professional training without necessarily going down the path of, like, university again. Yeah, so, I don't know. Depends what you want to do. Some people volunteer, and sometimes volunteering in a particular field can often lead to something deeper. For me right now, like, the hobby is content creation, so I've been trying to make more stuff on YouTube, and that makes me happy to do that stuff, so if it goes somewhere, then great, I can investigate that sort of path and take it more seriously, but for now, I'm all good. But it's not like I, you know, went to study or do anything for those qualifications. Like, I haven't really done anything in marketing. <laughs> it's just... I mean, okay, I know a bit of it, but... Nothing formal. Wait. Oh, no, I have the wrong counter table. Hang on. Okay, that one's in the correct style. You feel like there's too many degrees that are totally necessary? Uh, it depends. Like, if you're talking about specifically, say, law and medicine... Uh, yeah. But then... 
And I don't want to, I don't want to downplay, like, someone who got a degree in a particular field. I'm not trying to do that at all, but, like, there's other ones where it's just a case of you could learn the skills separately and then your degree, like, any other degree proves that you're organized. And as long as you can prove that you've done the job, who cares whether or not, like, it was done within the context of a degree. Right? Like... I guess design's the one that I can have the most experience with, but, you know, I have a degree in design, but there are people that I know didn't go to university and have jobs in design because they have a portfolio that proves they have the skill. And I think there's just a lot of jobs where that's the case is like, the degree is nice, but it's not the end of the world. It's like, if you see that there's proof that they can do the job, who cares about the degree? Again, I don't want to, I don't want to devalue anyone's degree, but that's just how I personally feel about it. Not everything. There are definitely degrees where it's like, you need it for what you're doing, right? Law and medicine are the two that come to mind. I'm sure there's others. Where is this counter? Value it. Don't be a gentle parent. Well, I'm not trying to be a gentle parent. It's more. It's someone's achievement, you know? I can definitely say how I. how I feel about my degree. But I don't want to shit on someone's parade <laughs> to prove a point. just not me. I have a relative in my family that does that, that like, every, I'm not, I'm not exaggerating, every single conversation you have with this relative of mine, they will devalue what you've done. So for example, let's say you and I are talking and I'm saying, oh, I just bought this new TV. I, I really like this new TV, you know? If she is in the room, she'll be like, Oh, I saw that TV the other week. Uh, it was on sale for like half off. It's because it's the old model and they've got this new one coming coming out. And she does this no mat she does this no matter what, even though she she doesn't know what she's talking about. She tried to do that with um the game console, like, so... She tried to do that with the Wii when I got it, because I worked hard for it, and... My cousins got some... What did they get? I forgot what they got, but... She tried to devalue the Wii. And said that she saw it, like, $100 off or something. And I was... At that point, I was working at Kmart, in the gaming section. I knew that these things were flying out the door. No way Nintendo ever prices things like that. And I just, I, I got so annoyed that I just straight up, like, called her out on it. Because I was like, yeah, no, that's, that's not, that's not the case. That would never happen. First of all, this thing only came out two weeks ago. So no way they'd cut it by a hundred dollars. That's, you're talking about a 30% discount. Secondly... <laughs> You know, I work in the department that sell these things, so I, I know for a fact that even if they were several years old, there's no way they would ever go down to that price. Those retailers would be selling it at a loss if they did that. And, oh man, my dad, he was funny. Because my uncle was not happy that... Here's the thing. For me... Respect is not automatic. Respect is something where it's not a one-way street, where just because someone's older than you or a relative that they automatically get it. Especially at that point where I was, you know, a teenager, I was working, approaching an adult. It's like, respect wasn't automatic to me. So, you know, my uncle was upset that I had spoken that way, despite everything I said being the truth. And that, um, it's... 
everyone in the family knows this, that, you know, the way she speaks is always to devalue people. So he had a word with my dad and was saying, you know, you should reprimand him for saying, speaking that way. And my dad just laughed at him and was like, nah. <laughs> Ev why? Everything, everything he said was, was true. He was defending himself. He did the right thing. So, yeah. That's why I don't like to devalue things, because it just takes me back to a place where, uh, it's, I just hear those conversations. It's just, I don't know, it, it comes from a place of insecurity, like trying to devalue other people's things and justify whatever you purchased or whatever you have, you know? How old was I? I would have been 17 at the time. Maybe 18. I have to figure it, I have to figure it out. It's like loosely then. Probably 18. And they spoke to my dad. Listen, I don't want to get into it. But yes, they did. <laughs> Just if that doesn't paint you a picture of like the sort of relationship I had with that side of the family, I don't know what does. I think that, I don't know, I think I can start ignoring this now. But yeah, I, I, I will try not to devalue stuff. But I guess when it comes to my own degree, I have my opinion about it. That's all. Say so, hey, Nikto. Like, when everything is, is said and done, can, can I say that... Would I be in the job that I'm in now? if I didn't go to university? The answer is probably yes. Like, I'd say 85 to 90% certainty that I would probably be in the industry that I'm in still. Given the circumstances around how I got work, yeah. I just need to adjust this to be white. That's all. I forgot. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> hey. Hold on. It's with situations like that that I I learnt. It's just. You can't pick your family, but you can. No, sorry, you can't pick your blood relatives, but you can definitely pick your family. That's what I was trying to say. There could be overlap between the two, but they're not exclusive. shit on your degree. I'm not going to shit on your degree. <laughs> I know it's Valentine's Day and all, but I'm, I'm not about to do that. I forgot what we were talking about before that.
But I guess that's the other thing is part of the jaded attitude towards degrees is just the stuff that some of my younger relatives have gone through to uh, get their qualifications. It's like so much more annoying than what it, than what it used to be when I got mine. Like, it's almost pretty blatant that they've just adjusted things so they make the most money out of it. Well, the universities, that is. Okay. Yeah. I think that's all I wanted to add here. This is more or less done. I, uh, I hit speakers everywhere with little, little radios to try and get the music to play all throughout this. Okay, uh, I'm gonna craft the gold watch and put it on that counter. I think that's the only thing missing. But I guess... The conversation started with, like, wanting to swap careers, and it's just, well, it's not too late to do that. Especially if you're not happy with it. I don't know. It's just the whole thing of, like, picking... Ha just, the just think about the insanity of it. Like, you're asking teenagers to decide what they want to do for 50 years of their life. And if they don't figure it out by their 20s, like, people make a big deal out of it. That is just insane. If you think, just think about that on a fundamental level. It is just insanity. How we just push for that. So if you feel like you want to do something different in your 30s, just do something different. Don't be afraid of it too much. There's definitely risk for sure and hard work. I'm not gonna, you know, make it sound like it's easy, but it's not like, disastrous to want to do that. I know plenty of people that did that. One, they're more happier, and two, they're generally more interesting people to talk to. Than people that are just kind of going with the flow and thinking they need to stay in the job that they're in. Changed my opinion about the gold watch. I thought it'd look weird on the counter there, but it's fine. Alright. Uh oh yeah, right. Check this. I can't remember if this was real or not. Let's see. It's fake. <laughs> of course it is. Alright, well. Nah, I'm good. I think that's it. Alright, so let me work on... Counter table, counter table. I don't need that. Um, wait, what happened to my lights? I got some lights that I wanted to use for this. I'm paying attention to the time as well today. I want to get to Warrior. <laughs> I'm going to make an effort to get closer to finishing that game. Hey, Seth, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. And hey, cozy butts. Hello from Ireland. Hello. I would assume you're just starting your day. I 
I think I put it away. Hold on. Didn't sleep yet. It's almost 9 a.m. Well, you have two choices. You can stay up. Or you sleep and ruin your your sleeping pattern. I mean, it depends if you have stuff to do today. Where is it? It should be around here. I think I passed it. <laughs> Hold on. It's weird to me that they added search in one part of the game and not all of it. Am I, am I losing it, isn't it? Did I not order it? I swear I ordered one. There's the stand. Okay, hang on, start from the top. <laughs> I'm sorry, It's it's been a bit of a week already and it's only Wednesday. It's been hot here, and today it cooled down, so... I might just leave it for now and just keep going. I don't want to drive people insane. Hey, it came from YouTube? Cool. Well, thanks for popping in. 3.52 in the morning? Oh man, what are you doing up? <laughs> Alright, we got all the Insomniacs here and the Early Risers. It's like the Australian special. Time zones will be better in about two months' time where... What, we go back an hour and then everyone goes forward. So then it sort of adjusts and the time is a lot better. Alright, I give up. <laughs> this, I know I bought one, I don't know where it is. I'm just gonna keep going with the rest of it. So many toilets, so many questions. I mean, the game gives you items, I don't control them. It's not like I've bought whatever number of toilets I have. Man, shooting stars are going crazy. Alright, there we go. So, let me just continue this. That reminds me, I was going to make solid gold toilets for my house. I need to do that. But if you think if you think about it, right? Like how many toilets is too many for you to laugh at me? Like let's say I have 8. I don't know how many toilets I have, but let's say 8. Let's say I have 8 of them. I have 8 I have more than 8 villages to design houses for. So it's not that strange, is it? I had five floor toilets. Okay, well that's why. It's because it's the floor toilets. Like, I'm not going to use them. I just have them there in case... Maybe I get an idea. Because as nice as some of this stuff looks, like, sometimes I do make things to be funny. <laughs> it's not always in the interest of making things look nice, right? Okay, um, this is a good thing that I bought. I did catch more f of the fish, so then I can make more fish and chips. I'm 
I mean, I'm glad you find joy in me having multiple toilets. Hey, Star, how's it going? This is going to bother me. I swear I bought one. Oh, what? When did I get that? Oh, it must have been, you know, the float thing. That's neat. Wish I had all of this to work with. <laughs> That's why Animal Crossing is good. Okay, you're exaggerating. I had I had four. That's not five. That's a bidet. And then that's a tankless toilet. I think I need to give up on this. <laughs> What if it's still in my mailbox and I'm just like... Hang on. What am I working on? I was reorganizing my beach, shifting around a lot of things. We'll see in a minute. But the first being redoing the fish and chips restaurant that I had. Dude. Uh, I'm sure I've gotten more than 20 now. I can probably stop, right? No, yeah, I don't... Oh, yeah, there it is. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Just wasted everyone's time! It, it was here. But I wasn't going crazy, I definitely ordered one. But I apologize. Okay, but more importantly... Give me a minute. <laughs> Give me a minute. I think it goes back into storage, doesn't it? Oh no, okay, I have it on me. Good. Oh, but it's like... I don't know if I like the look of that. I feel like I'm gonna ruin it if... Well, I guess... Uh, it's missing the, It's missing the other part of it, like the... the cover lid. Like... Okay, look at this. Well, look at the one I have in here, right? It's missing the- it's missing the tank. Okay, you know what? I'll make the- uh, I'll make the one in the bedroom gold. I'll make the one here gold and the other ones can remain normal. I don't think I want to ruin the interior. <laughs> as funny as it is.
Yeah, see, it, without the tank, it just looks weird. Or does it have a small tank behind it? No. You know, for a golden toilet, it's not really luxurious. You would think it'd be more luxurious than that, like, have a computer that sings you songs and stuff. Alright, I'm just gonna go back to what it was. I swear it had a tank. Well, yeah, it's like, what, what good is a toilet made out of solid gold if it if that's all it does? Would you rather a solid go gold toilet or a toilet that's, like, futuristic? It's... The fact that it's high in technology would imply that it's expensive, you know? I feel like things that are solid gold aren't as valued as they used to be. Which one did I have? That one, that's the one. No, it wasn't that one. That just looks like there's something possessed about to come out of the toilet. Ah, uh, it was this one. It was this one. Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> I mean, it, it wouldn't be a realistic public bathroom if something like that wasn't going on. It's usually the one in the corner that's the most gnarly. Okay, well, I made my gold toilet. Uh, while I'm here, let me put away other junk that I don't need. Oh, no, that, okay, that's a spare. I was like, didn't I put all of them down? Hold on, am I... I guess it didn't use the toilet, so I just crafted a golden toilet without nothing. Alright, that's fine. Anyway. I'm a little bit slow today. <laughs> okay, toilet humor aside, uh, I'm gonna go back to, like, making things look nice. Gee, well, what did you do for Valentine's Day? Oh, I just talked to people about toilets for like 30 minutes. You forgot it's Valentine's Day? Same. Honestly. The game, the game reminded me, and then I was like, oh, right. Hopefully this works. Ah, uh, you can't place a wall directly under it. Okay, so the only way this is going to work is if I get rid of this wall. That's somewhat of an annoying restriction. Yeah, okay. Do you have a dentist appointment today? It's fine. So I, I said earlier, it's just... There's no need to worry about it unless 
you're into it, or like, you're with someone that's into it. So, so, don't need an excuse to do anything that you do on Valentine's Day outside of Valentine's Day. Um, you know, Valentine's Day tax. <laughs> just things being more expensive just because it's the day. Some restaurants do surcharges as well. Like, it's kind of annoying. I'll... Hold on. Yeah, that's lame, but... I don't think I can do what I want. Um, I'm gonna have to change plan. I thought I could fit the lights in, but it's not gonna work out. So I'll go with plan B. I'll just get some other general lighting and place it there. I don't know if I can even fit it. I think because this technically comes out half, it's like, it'll make it awkward to walk through. Let me see what happens if I just get, uh, like a lamp or something. Just to see if I can even do anything. Otherwise, I'll just get more of the panels and just fill it up. Yeah, I mean, oh, but that's a big one. It has to be something small, like this. By the sounds of it, most people here don't have plans, <laughs> so. It's okay, everyone's a monk's good company. It's just, it depends what the expectation is, is like, whether you want to do something not just romantic and spontaneous, or you just want to go somewhere expensive. I don't think this is going to work. I think, yeah. It's not enough room. All right, I'll get, I'll get panels. It's fine. I can't pull this out one more. I think it'd just look too, too cluttered. Cause yeah, that would be like right up against the beach. Otherwise, and I can't pull it back one because this part can't go back out one. All right, that's fine. I'll just settle for that. Um, I gotta get two more simple panels. And I gotta make more food. So... Where are they? Oh yeah, and I gotta get a flick too. I'll get smaller butterflies, so... Get that made as a model. And... Where are the dab? I'm content that I got more, so I kind of figured that I would want to do something more with this. Okay. Oh! <laughs> Onion rings. Okay, you can see what it is. I didn't know that. I was trying to cook on them. I think I can ignore it now. Uh, oh, there, there we go. I'm so glad that I, uh, I preempted this. Gotta go to work. Alright, no worries, Seth. Uh, thanks for the following for popping in. Appreciate it. Hopefully see you around. I think I hit my foot. <laughs> I don't know if you heard that.
It really doesn't like this area. It, you can see it load in. But I like this more than what I had. Okay. Place. Place. Doesn't matter, it's a fish and chips shop. Okay. They do one thing and they do it well. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna get some gyroids out. Let's see. You. Maybe you. Alright. Let's pick three random ones. I think this is the best idea that I've had for this game, honestly. <laughs> that one... That one in particular... The way it moves its head, it definitely looks like it's trying to eat. Wait, why is that one on its... Why is that last one the plate of food? place differently. I think because I placed it from here. I mean, do I go for consistency or do I just say leave it? Maybe I need a... This is just like such an OCD detail. Yeah. No, 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 now I'll, I'll follow through. I'll make the other one different placed as well, and then... Well, it's a case of they all either have to be the same, or they all have to be different. It's okay. I would rather them all be different. There we go. Better? Better. <laughs> it's okay. If I didn't adjust it now, it would have bothered me over time, slowly. It just would have kept eating at me. Until eventually I, I would have changed it. Alright. Do I have any short? I don't have any short simple panels, so I have to order two more. Okay. I got that. Let me just check if there's anything else. No. Okay, now I understand why there's football themed stuff. It didn't click. <laughs> Short, simple panel. One, two. 
Okay. Alright, now I'm gonna rework this area here. Uh, first, I'm just gonna give the butterflies the flick before I forget. Good audio. Oh, I haven't. I don't think I've gone in here today. Hang on. I need to sell anyway. Oh. I'll buy this. That's the strange thing is, of all the houses, I did not give a single one a washing machine or a dryer. Like, I kind of just left it out. <laughs> I wonder if I should make like a little laundromat area just to make up for that. I mean, they have, they have this, just, I don't know. I could make a laundromat. Dip it in the ocean and sun dry, yeah. I don't know, priorities. All right, not to sell, not to sell. I'm here to get a model. Art. I just want more tiny ones. Because the big ones, they're kind of impractical. I did end up using them. But they were not good. I wanted to use them in the more natural looking house design. Like, uh, yeah, I want to put some around here. Just a couple. I got one here. I just want to scatter a few more, you know? Let's do this. <laughs> really doesn't like this area. Okay, so I'm gonna improve the farm area, I think, a bit. Especially now that I have the market, so. Let's see what I have. I know I bought a bunch of uh, wheat. Okay, so there's one. Got some wheat fields. I'll get a few out. We got this, the milk can. Um, this. There's quite a few we can use here. Oh yeah, I can get bags of soil, so we can take these to be customized. Get a couple of those. Maybe boxes. Uh, 
bucket? Eh, I don't know about that. Maybe. These can be customized to be different things, so I got two out. Okay, well, that should do to start us off. Okay, first thing I'm gonna do is get rid of this fence here, because it's no longer applicable. I'll probably continue the fence downwards. don't really have a plan, I'm just gonna see how it goes. <laughs> Much like, uh, I guess this, yeah. I had a loose idea. I might even bring back a little pond, I'm not sure. We'll see. Okay, so... We'll make the literal fencing stop here. I'm gonna do this. The wheat fields are kind of annoying to place because they have a mind of their own, but we'll see. I mean, so far, so good. going to alter this as well, so... in the way. I think it's in the way. Hang on. Yep. Okay. There we go. Alright. Implied fencing. As so. So 
so this goes in the middle. I'm pretty sure I have enough wheat to last. See, this is what I mean. <laughs> Stop! And I can't drag it because you walk into it, so it's just... It has a mind of its own and you just have to trick it. Okay, there we go. I think I need to get more out. Okay, anyway. This is now where I can make stuff make sense, so... that machine thing. Yep. I need one more wheat. Two more, actually. be decorative just as fuel so but I don't know which would you associate with fuel more red or black for some reason red but I don't know associate with like holding fuel a plastic canister that's colored red or one that's colored black I don't know why, but red seems to be more correct for me. Red? Yeah, I thought so. Thought they have to be red? Uh, pff, I don't know. It's news to me. Hey, Varna. How's it going? Um, red safety cans are required by OSHA for highly flammable liquids. Um, is that an international organization? Because if not, that might be why. I don't know. Well, I have a red one, so I do agree red. Either way, even if whether or not it's enforced, yeah. I need to go to halves unless I can customize it here. Yeah, we can place that there. The fuel kind of stuff. Okay, so. Woke up, saw that I was late, but it's 3 a.m. So you go back to sleep. <laughs> Honestly, fair enough. I would too.
I might pay for this first, actually. Wanted to say hi, though, and have a good stream. Sorry for missing the live. Uh, don't apologize. I'm, like, on the opposite side of the planet. It'll get better in two months when the time zones shift again, and then it won't be 3 a.m. Well, it'll be, like, what, 2? No, 1. 1 a.m. Yeah. Then it's easier for me to start earlier, because then it's like, well, it's not too late at night for most people. Caught up in thought. I'm not sure if I want to place this. I'm debating it. It just... it's too... too massive. Nah, I'm gonna avoid it. <laughs> Good night, yeah. Sleep well. I'm gonna go customize the bags, I'll be back. Yeah, I mean, this wasn't gonna do too much tinkering, I don't think. Like, I think it... It was fine. Just mild adjustments here and there. I might put like a... Somewhere to sit here, maybe. I'll put crafting here. Yeah. I'll figure it out. I got it. Oh, I'm, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm looking for the storage shed, but I put it away. It's not here anymore. Sorry, right, I'll go to halves. I'm running around in circles looking for something that's in my pocket currently. Just force of habit. It's usually there. All right. I want to see if I have, uh, other stuff. Like a shed. Uh, okay. Give me a minute. Generate, eh. Okay, uh... These apparently already have... Uh, I assume these ones are just wood already. I'll get five of them. That could be useful. Uh, I like this chair. I'm gonna have to order another one. 
just to have as uh, a place to sit down there. And I guess maybe just the natural square table. Let me see what I can do with this. This could be nice. What's in my pocket? It's taking up room. Went back to the wrong one. Potato, fish. Plastic canister, party light arc. Floor lamp. Uh, I can use that. That can go. Got some huge pockets. <laughs> I mean, that's most games. Just video game logic. In terms of storage is funny. Particularly when I get like a whole shark or a sunfish, which are just they dwarf humans sometimes, just shoving that in my pocket. Alright, for now. Yeah, you can put whole sheds in there. Statue of Liberty, that giant statue that I put in the garden. I like having this. This is good. So we'll do soil and then we'll do burlap sacks. Both make sense. So these ones as well. This dude's made just easily a million bells off me. The amount of things I've had to customize. Cardboard box. Yeah, okay. I mean, I thought there might be something vegetable-oriented, but there isn't, so leave it. Um, this is the one I wanted to see. I mean... I think this could look nice. Just because something is a little run down doesn't mean that it doesn't fit the aesthetic, you know? Yeah. 
What else? I'll change the color so then it doesn't look like the other ones. Ah, yeah, just go with that. This is more for aesthetic than actual functionality. That one. It might look good. what I have in my head. <laughs> like, the colors match. Alright, I think that's everything. I need to order another metal and wood chair. So, let's do that real quick. Metal and wood chair. Let's just go with that one. It's just the flowers. Dude. Nintendo console, please. Okay, give me a minute. Um, instruction. Why you do this? <laughs> okay. Two hedges here. Those back one. Yeah. 
Yeah. Uh, hang on. I might move them around. Let me just mess around with this a little more. Like, okay, if this was... I'm almost tempted to get rid of that as well, but, like, if I was to... Where is it? Where did it go? There. Okay. Because it is just an eyesore and it doesn't really... I know, I'm aware. Practicality. It, it's good. Just trying to think of how else I could place it without placing it, you know? <laughs> uh, I mean, I guess the alternative, right, is if I do this. Might work out now. And then this just goes here. Okay, no. No, 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 no. I got this, I got this, I got this. Okay. Even if this does make this a little asymmetrical, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Or, no. Hold on. I'll adjust it. going to shift it forward. And I can get rid of the, the back fencing that way too. Because then it's an implied wall. that's bothering me the most right now is in the background just those shooting stars going off it's just it makes me want to turn around okay look what this allows me to do now Now this kind of makes sense. A drain. And I will put this here. Then this. Place here. Okay, that makes sense. And now I just repeat the same here.
Is this gonna land somewhere awkward? Oh. <laughs> okay, hold on. I can't. Not yet. But it's there. It's not gonna vanish. area to its fullest. I just noticed something. That is a corner piece. Stress test this. <laughs> Bothering me a little. may need another one. We shall see. As long as it looks like it's a bit of a, a shed, you know? That's what I'm going for with this. I think it should work. Okay. Alright, so... I might need one more panel. We'll see. Uh, place that here. Maybe not. Like, I think if I have the picture in my head correct, I don't think I need one. No, I think I got it right. I think I got it right. I got one more space here. That's fine. Yeah. Um, this can go 
go here. I mean, it's, it's working. Uh... I mean, maybe I can even do that and then put that on top. As long as it looks like it's just storing bomb stuff, it's fine. Yeah. Um, let's finish this up. I'm going to seal it, and then that center part is like the way out. So now that that's sealed, right? I'm just thinking what else I should do. Okay. Do I need to do anything? Maybe not. I'll see what else I have, but this is good. I'm happy with this. More or less the intended result. Oh, yeah, now do this. Just add to the whole. Okay, then these ones will go here. Yeah. I might get a barrel. I think I can make a barrel and then just put it behind. So I'll put a barrel and this umbrella. I think I can just craft barrels if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Uh, maybe a butter churn as well. Just other random farm stuff. Uh, okay, iron and wood, got it. I need to get more wood. I'm pretty sure this can be customized to be like a old barrel as well. Oh, barrel can't be customized. Okay, my bad. Yeah, okay. See what else I can place. I mean, even I'm 
I'm curious if this can be done. Can't see any reason why not. Like, if I go... Drop. Yeah, <laughs> it works. So you can do that. Just, it's like a little detail. Okay. Where is it? I think I put the wrong one up. Damn it. <laughs> I was supposed... My bad. But it works. I just put the wrong one up. That's the one I wanted to plant. Should have been careful. This is the one I just wanted to just drop up there. Probably more I can do, but for now. So these will eventually grow out. All right. Now, I got this. Uh, da -da -da -da. Is the animation that laggy that it just... Hmm. It doesn't appear to like it. Anyway. Um... One more check and go there. I'm just curious if I can push this out like a little bit. I think I can. It's okay, I'll adjust. I'll adjust. Without placing a literal fence, do that. So then I can have somewhere to cook here. Oh, while well, I'm at it. <laughs> is it this is it really that laggy now that I have too much stuff where it's not even doing the animation to drop the items? I'm concerned. It might be time that I, uh, I clean up the flowers. As much as I've been saying that over and over again, I'm concerned for my game. I don't know if I have another outdoor kitchen, though. I might just be out of them. Yeah, I don't have one. Okay. I have to order. I mean, I didn't adjust too much. I think I kept things more or less the same. It's just 
think now this definitely looks more like a, a farm. Particularly with this, this is awesome. Continue this. I'm gonna ignore it because I think at this point I have all I need for it. Okay. So here I'll put the outdoor... I mean, I may as well make the brickwork go all the way to the end. Okay. bothering me so much, even though I know I don't need to get it. Um, okay, hold on. I think it's just called Outdoor Kitchen. Outdoor Bench. Outdoor Kitchen. Uh, yeah, probably that one. Okay. Last round of changes. This one is more of an ambitious one, but I know it's doable. I'm gonna have to order more items, but I can do that at um Happy Home. I think. Did I order at Happy Home today? I may have already. I might be able to order a couple more. We'll see. I was going to place the butter churner, but I think I've decided against it. Oh. Wait, so I have the chairs already. No shit. Okay, I gotta go back to half zone. I thought I didn't. Oh well, uh, get something out. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. I'm gonna use this wood partition. Just for this part specifically. It's out of alignment, isn't it? Of course it is. I might not do that idea then, if it's gonna do that. Thought it might look good, but decided against it. Okay. Then we'll go back to this. It's 
it so bad if it does that? I'm not sure. I think it needs to go one higher. So then, hang on. This. And then I think it should end here. So then it's, it's just a little stretch where it's doing that. There we go. I think that's fine. Alright, I'm going to halves, get the chairs, and then... I guess... Oh, ooh, ooh. I know what I can do. And I know this definitely won't get in the way. Because there actually is room this time. Yeah, it's not liking what I'm doing. It is struggling. <laughs> it is struggling. Okay, so OBS crashed. Uh, if there's a bit of a gap, like sudden jump. This is why, because I've had to stitch two VODs together. I keep forgetting to restart my capture card every time I stream. I need to do this, because otherwise that happens. Like, eventually it just reaches a point where OBS just crashes. And it's not good for me. It means I have to do editing later. It's been a while, so, yeah, I forgot today. Anyway, nothing has happened. Still, I'm going to halves. I find the irony of me talking about, like, something happening, like, crashing. The game crashing because of too much stuff, and then the game doesn't crash. Instead, OBS does. Uh, well, that's one way to... The killer stream, I suppose. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so I need to make these two identical. I mean, I'm leaning more towards this, looking at the color that the table was. Somehow both of them weren't set to that. Alright. I think I'm good. It really couldn't hold out for like, I don't know, 15 more minutes. Alright.
Alright, that's looking good. I wanna see if I I think I can squeeze this in. Like if I do uh ah, let's see it's off center. Down. Can't go there, it has to go here. Because then, yeah. Okay. I mean, that's fine, I think. Chairs, I guess I can't sit in them. <laughs> it's alright, it's decorative. But yeah, I'll get the outdoor. The outdoor kitchen there. I mean, maybe this is overkill. Because then this won't be usable. Maybe I'm better off just doing garden light or something here. Probably a better option, let's see. have one. Yeah, I mean, maybe less is more in this case. if there's anything else I want to place. I think this is fine. I mean, I might have more supplies I can place, like maybe more bags. Let's see what I got. That's kind of out of place. Butter churn is, I don't know, kind of random too. Maybe the answer is simple, just do more of this. So I can't customize these without going to halves. At least that's something. Uh, yeah, I mean, fertilizer. I think it's fine to have more of it around. Just place a bag here. I'm curious, can I? Oh. Okay, that changes things. That changes things. Doesn't matter which one, just anyone. Did I get more bag? Ah, 
God. <laughs> really? There's still this one here as well. I forgot. All right. This does change things a little bit. Especially since they can be used to place things. Or are they? Yeah. Get a couple more out. So if I do... Hey, that works. Cool. It's just to make this more believable. Oh, you can even do that. That's not what I want to do, but it's no. Okay, um, turn, um... There we go. Okay. Place. It actually works, that's cool. Drop. Yeah, nice. Okay. And then... Place. No, not that one. Oh, hold on. I gotta be careful. Otherwise it's going to pick it up. I don't want it to be picked up. And then... Bags back where they were. Alright. Place a shovel. There's room. Don't lie to me. There's room. Turn it. There we go. Yeah, okay. Now, now this is looking good. Um, I'm gonna do... Place this as well. Oh, I can even do this. Awesome. Okay, let's farm music. thinking what should play here. Or maybe I could just, because you can do shuffle as well, can't you? Shuffle. Hmm. 
Yeah, we'll do shuffle. Treat it as like a radio here. <laughs> Wait a minute. I got I got an idea. Would this there's no way this would work. Hmm. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm gonna investigate this idea. If this looks good, I'm... Again, just... Brilliant ideas, so... What if the gyroids also work on the farms? Let's see. If it works, it works. So like if I... I guess I have to strategically place them, but... I don't want them to get in the way, that's the other thing. I need to think about where they get placed. I think what I need to do... Ooh, this is hard. Okay. I got it. So we'll put one here. I don't know if this works well. I'm not sure it's obvious that they're working. Okay, here we can put another one. Not that one. It needs to have arms. can next to this one so that it looks like it's watering. Face that way. Wait. That way. Ah, there we go. I think if I just place watering cans next to the, next to them, it'll look like. But what else can, can we do? Hang on. That one definitely looks like it's doing something. What else do I have? Yeah. 
As long as it makes it look like they're working on this farm. Put that there. Alright, so then the handle's facing them. Should probably do the same. Oh, no, that's fine. That angle's fine. <laughs> there you go, little gyroid workers. Just three of them. I think that's enough. I could probably put one here at the well. Oh, that's the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How does this one move? I don't see this one moving. It's not moving. Music's not close enough. I may have to hide music so then it moves. I'm surprised that doesn't reach. Okay, hang on. Bucket. Where's bucket? I know I have a bucket. This one's too far away. Okay, but it, I mean, at least it, it looks like it. I just need to... I think I need to put like a little music player here. Alright, I know what to do. Pull it back to here. Things you gotta do to make the gyroids move. I'm not sure I have another stereo though. Oh, I don't. I have this. I feel like that's too big though. I mean, let's see. If I can hide it, I'll hide it. It's kind of hard to hide this one. I mean, I need another portable radio. One way I can pull it off, it's just a little... Nah, but it probably won't reach it still. I'm thinking of placing... Like, taking these and placing one there. So then it has proximity, but I don't know. I suppose... This makes sense in the grand scheme of things, is like, do this. Hang on. Mm. 
then I guess if I flip it this way instead, then that's fine. I can't believe how useful these bags have become. I did not think they'd be that useful. I should have, yeah, I should have more. I'm glad I bought a lot of them. Just thinking if I should vary it up. Yeah, I'll go for a green bag just to have something different. Why not? Okay, and then I can place one more music source here. Which, it's dumb right now, I'll just swap it to... Do they sync up? Okay, they do good. Does it reach this one? It doesn't reach it. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Why is this one not moving? Bucket should definitely go there, either way. Why doesn't it reach it? It should be within range. It's in range of this one. Is it because of this? What's happening? Why, why is this not working? This should be working. This should be within range. I'm curious if it's because there's too many items, it just has like a cap. Oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> this this might be uh Hmm. The game might be hitting its limitations. Just just a little bit. Alright, look, I mean, the idea's fine. Let me clean up. I'm curious if I clean up some flowers, it'll, it'll magically fix it. If I was to take a guess, I think the answer would be yes. So what I'll do, I'll get rid of the ones that aren't hybrid. I have a suspicion that it's, it's just because there's too much junk here. But see, even these ones are dancing. I don't know why the other one isn't. Maybe it's just the gyro type. Okay, uh, regardless, I'm gonna see if I can buy another tape deck. Otherwise, I'll go to Happy Home and buy one. Tape deck. Tape deck. 
pipe deck. Okay. Alright, so all the non-hybrids are disappearing. Something that I should have done a long time ago, to be honest, but now that it's really, really lagging. Okay, one thing I can do to help this out a little is get rid of these items, as I'm not really doing anything with them right now. So let's just clean that up. see. I'm just thinking of the ones that I have plenty of, so. Roses, I have quite a few reds around. Let's sell these and see if it makes a difference. Otherwise I might try the gyro type. See, these ones aren't moving now anymore. Oh, right now it is. I have no idea why this one's not reacting. It should be. Yeah, that can go. That's... There we go. Same with this. Trying to reduce the object count. I think it's just a gyroid. Let me try placing another gyroid next to it and see what happens. I should probably plant these and see what I get. I might do that. Come on, this is like right next to it. Okay. 
Oh, this one's reacting. So, why not you? Aren't they the same type? What? <laughs> what is going on? Why doesn't this one react? This is definitely within the proximity of this. The hell? I don't get what's going on. Okay, it's reacting there. Now it's stopped reacting. Uh, hold on. I think it's just the gyroid type. I think that one's not very... Okay, don't use Babloid. Got it. Let's try another one. Maybe you? I saw it move. Admittedly, this is probably not the best. Oh, it moved. This is probably not the best track. I get the feeling the instrument it reacts to is just a very subtle one. Well, the other gyroids are just way more active. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this one reacts better. Yeah, I mean, as long as it looks like it's at work, that's just getting water from the well. I make a fake space this way. There we go. <laughs> Alright, that's cool. This one looks like it's working. Same with this one. As long as they look like they're working. I think they do. Okay, now I'm curious. If I get rid of this... Okay, so it was just a gyroid type. It was just a gyroid type. I don't need the extra audio there. It's just a gyroid type that was bad. Okay, noted. Um, I'm gonna see what watering can is on sale. Oh, you know what? No, yeah, I'll get the watering can. I was gonna put a can of drink, but nah. I'll just get a different watering can and place it on there. Felt like a waste of 15 minutes. Okay, uh... It doesn't matter. As long as it looks visually different. Though I probably could have made that myself. Going 
we go. Alright. This works. I guess just for the sake of... There we go. I mean, even... Hold on. A little bit of extra detailing. Because it makes sense. That's all I was going to do anyway. <laughs> I was going to get out of construction mode, but I was done anyway, so I don't really have much else I want to do with this. Good enough progress. I've ordered stuff for tomorrow, so... I think I definitely have to get around to cleaning now, because... The lag preventing animations from playing is concerning. It wasn't doing that before today, so I think I'm just kind of hitting a point where I have too many items down. But that'll be remedied by just cleaning up that gigantic mess you see everywhere. Honestly, I'm hoping it'll reduce the amount of items I have by quite a bit, so it should fix it. We'll see. Alright, well that's where I'm going to leave Animal Crossing for tonight. Yeah, it was nice, uh cleaning up that farm area and the uh, fish and chip shop, so, yeah. I'll, uh, I guess I'm gonna start moving around to the campsite area after a bit of cleanup, so that'll probably be next. I still need a few more flowers to duplicate, but we're getting close to the end of this uh, lengthy journey, so. Anyway, in the meantime, if you want to support the content over on YouTube, if you're checking this out later as a replay, Easiest way to do so is just to uh, hit the like button, subscribe, or any other, one of those other things that YouTubers keep telling you to do. It does help the channel out a lot, so thank you to those that do do that, but we'll do more of this soon. <laughs>